A pre-prom photo taken on the steps of a Wisconsin courthouse last spring, sparking a district investigation and international uproar. As you can see, dozens of then high school juniors seen making what appears to be a Nazi salute. Now, not all of the students in the photograph joined in that gesture, including Baraboo High School student Jordan Blue, who joins us now. Jordan, good to have you with us this morning. Um, your arm is not raised in that picture. A lot of people are looking at this and saying, what happened? Take us back to that moment on the steps of the courthouse and how this all came together. Um, just like any other day. Um, it was a great day. Um, any junior was excited for their prom day. Um, we were all, you know, getting excited and dressed up for the event. Um, and um, I just remember um, going to the courthouse that day, um, meeting for my prom photos. Um, it's most of my class, but not all of my class was there. Um, we took our full group photo. Um, and then our, um, the female part of our class took our, their photo, um, and they weren't asked to do any such pose or anything like that. Um, and then the guys were asked to go up there, um, and we went up there and we took some casual photos, mm -hmm. um, just like happy, smiley ones. Um, and if knowing the outcome of the situation, I would not have gone up there. Mm -hmm. Um if I would have known what was going on. Um, and it was a scary moment and it was very shocking and upsetting. And it was a, a, a huge misrepresentation of the school district and the community of Baraboo. You described that moment as scary. Mm -hmm. What happened in that moment? So who suggested that arms should be raised, and how explicit was that direction? Was it put your arm up in a Nazi salute? Was it raise one arm? What was the direction, and who did it come from? Um, I can't really speak on behalf of that, um, but I can say that it was, um, it was clued by the photographer, mm -hmm. um, but the way the students had taken it was out of control. Um, the photographer said to raise your hand, but he didn't say a specific way. Mm -hmm. um, and my peers should not have raised it in the specific way. Um, that was the offensive way and hurtful way. And do you remember in those moments, you say the photographer said he didn't say to raise your hand in a specific way. And I do want to share uh, with our viewers as well, the photographer Peter Gust putting out a statement saying, I didn't tell them to salute anything. It was waving goodbye to their parents, having a good time, high five. There was nothing that diminished the quality of anyone's life. He says there was nothing that diminished anyone's stature in society, nothing that was intended to point a finger at anyone in their class who may have some kind of difference. There was none of that. So you say he didn't give a specific direction in terms of a salute but that you were scared in the moment, you felt uncomfortable. Were there rumblings among the other guys standing there on the steps with you? Oh, hey, let's turn this into some sort of a Nazi salute. Did you hear any sort of rumblings? Um, I didn't hear any grumblings, um, but I, I did see the amount of intent that was in some of my peers' arms. Um, and then at that moment, I was uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. um, and I was very, I was very hurt. Um, I was very scared for the future, um, and even if they knew what they were doing, they still did it, and it was wrong, mm -hmm. and it shouldn't be okay, um, and it's not okay. Before this photo went viral and there was all this attention, was this a point of discussion after that picture was taken? Uh, with some of the people in the picture? Did anybody express to you that they had any regrets for taking part? Um, I personally didn't hear any people um, have any feedback after this photo was taken. Um, I know for myself, I had a lot of questions, a lot of unknowns. Um, I wasn't sure whether where this photo was even going to be. Mm -hmm. I didn't even know it existed until I saw it Sunday night. Um, I knew it existed, but I also didn't know it was taken and published somewhere. Okay. I know in those moments you were feeling scary. Um, I wanted to check in with you during the break so we could say hello before the interview, and you said you're feeling encouraged today, that a lot of people have reached out to you. 
uh, mm -hmm. with words of support, with messages of support. How is everyone in the community handling this today, Jordan? Um, our community is very hurt, very distraught. Um, Baraboo is a phenomenal community um, and is not a racist community. Um, we're very close. So when an event like this happens, it affects all of us. Um, and this photo is not a representation of the senior class at my high school. Um, it's just a very bad situation that happened. Um, and we have a lot of growing and learning to do. Mm -hmm. We should point out to the, um, as we mentioned, the, the superintendent said that they are looking into all of this. The local police said they can assist in any way uh, that is needed. Jordan, we appreciate you taking the time to join us today. Thank you. Yep, no problem.